Gina wants to come and stop at the party. He's a total party person. He's like, I'll come stand at the food and the treats, chat with you guys. So last week I asked Fiona, what did she notice different about the girls? And this week, I'm gonna tell you what the girls noticed about not having Fiona. So Fiona was gone for a few months, like four months, and they noticed a long warm up. <laughs> so he's like, oh my goodness, Finny be swimming before we even ride. Sure. Are you Please. <laughs> Let's see, Gabby, do it. Gabby's gonna drink on a moving horse. <laughs> there. Big and slow. Think floaty. Maybe we should give Sophie a cup of water, a bottle of water. Thanks. <laughs> that was close. Give Sophie a bottle of water. See if she can rise really fast while drinking. Not, I got a lot of layers on. <laughs> Gabby's got the, the sugar in her. <laughs> you know, you can tell. Happy Gabby yeah. equals sugar I Gabby. Horse. I love that horse too. Brennan and I were talking about it the other day too. Like, he, uh, we all love him. So a lot of people are saying that Chino's building more muscle when she sits, sits on him instead of two, uh, instead of two point, instead of light seat. That driving them and pushing them is making them. <laughs> it's just so funny to see a happy Gabby. Not even that she's not happy, just like a giggly, giddy, uh, a talkative Gabby. Because it's not that she's not uh, not happy. And it's the same with Sam. Like they don't respond. Like when you talk to them, they don't respond. Yeah, they're just quiet. Mm -hmm. They're introverts. Uh, pff, Gabby. <laughs> Not relying on your reins. Use your breathing and your seat. Plan that a little more ahead of time there, pumpkin. I didn't mine too far ahead, so I turned way too early. And she turns way too late. Good use of your outside rain on that corner. Did you do that just because you were in front of me? <laughs> Imagine a time when you grow up and you have a trainer all the time. So pretty much every time you ride, there's a trainer there. And when there isn't a trainer there, it's just when you ride extra. But you know that there's a looming threat of your trainer being around at any given time. Like we did before, yeah. For their whole life. And then suddenly there's no trainer there. It is insane the things that you give up when there's no trainer there. Yep. You do things a lot more. Breathe. Working trot. Gabby's using that outside rain and she's gonna stack her bowling ball on her plate. People are saying that stacking her plates has really made a difference. Look at that beautiful horse. You sit up tall and put yourself together. Get off his inside rain and he puts himself together as well. Yay! Hey, you don't even have to work for it. Just put yourself together and wham bam, thank you ma'am. Processing. Lift your hand up and close your fingers. I know, it's the worst thing in the world. Oh, there are a lot of things made way worse than that in the world. Like... Trotting on Chino? Not so much fun. No. <laughs> Working trot! I mean, she just drank. The control. We well should, done. We should make her drink while she's sit trotting. Alright, breathe! That's just mean. That'd be funny. Oh, so hard. Yeah, you should watch this. Heavy, lean back. Find his mouth and gently hold it and then work the elbow. Remember the summertime? Well, I guess it was the fall. We really worked on those elbows? Yeah. Yeah. She said that she knows she needs help with that. She what? She admitted the other day that she hasn't been doing elbows very well. Alright, so a little softer on the rein. He grabbed me, he's opening his mouth, getting burgundy with him. So a little, little looser, but let the arm go with him. More legs. I need to do that too. <laughs> elbows, elbows, <laughs> elbows, shoulders up, chest out, elbows, elbows, thumbs on top. Out. There we go. Canter poles on the far side of the ring, please. Not beside me. 
Good. So your elbows stop working as soon as you hit the pose. You're like, I, I need, I need hands, elbows, elbows, elbows. Good. Over exaggerate over the pole. Over exaggerate. Good job. Look, breathe, eyes up. Good. You are going to come over the canter poles again. We are going to count how many strides you get before the first pole and after the last two. Three, four, five. Come again. One, two, three, four, five. Pull, pull. One, two, three. Good. Come again. Three. And one, two, three, four, five. Almost. One, two, three, four, five. Pull, pull. One, two, three. Three. Beautiful. Now we're going to go six and four. Shortening his stride. And one, two, three, four, five. Nice five. <laughs> one, two, three, and a half. Let's do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six. I guess you need a little bit more light. Keep going. Fix your back lead. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, one, two, three, four. Better. You got your four on the back end. When we did this jump, we had five, two poles, and three, right? Yeah. So we will have five and four. Where's the way? Oh. Oh, we it. Yeah. Hands forward. Don't worry about it. Better. Look up. Look up. Ride through the corner. You need to leg yield. Come to me. I'm over here. Ride to me. The boy. Look up. Turn. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, well, you can have it now. You lost your stirrup. Look up. Hands forward. One, two, three, four, five. Jump. One, two, three, four. Good. Outside leg. Look through the turn. One, two, three, four, five. Ride it again. It should be a four. One, two, three, four. Feel better? Yeah. Yeah, way nicer. Look up. Leg yielding to your sister. Making him use the corner. Good distance. Very nice. Good lead change timing too. Same thing here. Leg yielding over to the corner. Not letting him drop. Good. Look. One, two, three, four, five. Jump it. Do it again. The whole course? Just that one. One, two, three, four, five. Jump. One, two, three, four. Good. I want five and five. One, two, three. Breathe out. One, two, three, four and a half. Got better. Let's try six and five. Maybe it'll be easier coming in. Quiet. Two, three, four, five, six. Release. One, two, three, four, five. Beautiful. One more time with a five and a four. Let them ride it nice and long. Breathe. One, two, three, four, five. And again, because that was ugly. That was ugly. <laughs> forward, hand forward. One, two, three, four. Release. One, two, three, four. Beautiful. Let them walk. We're going to try and not play with our reins so much. Yeah. Keep them at one length and then follow through. If they're sliding through your fingers, you need to hold them tighter so they don't. Look up. One, two, three, four. Lovely. One, two, three, four. So it's four and four on that side. Okay. Looking up. One, two, three. Lovely leg yield. Beautiful. Nice lead change on the leg yield. Same thing here. Leg yield over and do the change. Circle. Don't play with your hands. Good. Now look. Ride the five and four. One, two, three, four, five. Good. One, two, three, four. Four, ride the course again. 
One, two, three, four. Lovely. Two, three, four. Beautiful. Ride to the corner. Think about the leg heel. Nice. Coming into this jump, I want you bent towards me, but pushing you over already. Don't you know that you're beautiful?